and welcome back to Plants and Zombies Heroes Tournament. So, uh, let's begin with our first Plant and Zombie Hero Tournament. Of course, we'll just be doing random decks. So, if a Plant and Hero and a Zombie Hero fails once, they're getting eliminated. Tournament ends when one side runs out of Zombie Heroes or Plant Heroes. And that's it. Let's start then. Random Plant Hero and random Zombie Heroes who get to fight against each other. And uh, yeah, this series season number 8, guys, after this season, we've officially reached the highest of all states of seasons. Season 9 and season 10, the most and the best seasons out of all, Hacked the Dex Tournament. Keep your eyes peeled, man, because it's gonna be the most amazing thing you've ever watched. Oh yes, baby, oh yes it is, guys. Cytron and Immortitia, oh yes. Alright, Cytron and Immortitia, cool Immortitia, it looks like my random deck against yours. <laughs> So Cyclone will just get eliminated first, right? Uh, I mean... It depends. Oh, yeah, and I'm letting you play Heroes and Zombie Heroes reshuffle this time around, so uh, you have more freedom to get what you want. Oh, that's much better then. Good. Well, if you know what you want from your deck, because after all, these decks are still random. Sure. You shouldn't even reshuffle, but... We might want the one castings and the two castings, because they buy more time for the later turns in their glory. We gotta make sure of that. Yeah, Immortisha. All right. All right. Oh, there you go. Your teams are ready. Exactly. Nice. So Immortisha, immortal randomness. Ah, right, let's see. Which one of you will lose their decks? Uh, we only have one deck. Hello. Yeah, we only have one deck. Your deck. Yeah, and then Professor Brainstorm has probably a cool scientific fact that he wants to uh, tell the whoever plant hero he's going to fight. Oh sure, Professor Brainstorm always has something genius facts about everything pretty much. Yup, absolutely gonna love that fact actually. <laughs> All right, I think you got something like something like there are more cards in the combinations than there are atoms on Earth. Exactly, in glory, but do not tell them yet. Oops. Ah, damn it, you told them! <laughs> well, immortal <laughs> randomness. <laughs> Gee, I didn't know that. That's a cool fact. Anyways, let's do this. I wanna win, Cytron. Well, I need to clean my glasses. Right now? Yes. Jeez. Flippity flip. Have you flipped your glasses up or what? Oh, Immortisha, I'm here. Jeez. Hold up, they're still not clean enough. Jesus, come on. I don't know, I thought I cleaned this, but this, there's still a trail on it. Oh, there you go. Let me brief on it a bit. Yup, that helped. Now they're clean. What's about time, Cytron? Like, seriously, not even I spent so much time cleaning my wands. Like, honestly. <laughs> what took you so much, dear? Well, you know, I had to make sure I cleaned them properly, so... Alright, let's just start then. Cytron's random, Messi Morticia. I'ma bring you down with this. Hurrah! <laughs> now you're done, dear. Has it at the dark magic? We have full advantage over this. Do not try to prevent it, Cytron. You know it's not gonna work. Well, sure, I hope it is. <laughs> well, you'll be disappointed to know, dear, that Supernova Gargantuar is a 5-7 attacking one. Oh, yes, bring him, lady. I got Doom Shroom and Spring Bean. Huh. He's not gonna be able to survive. Ah, sure, Cytron. You think that's how it's gonna go? Interdimensional zombie! Electrician! Kite flyer! Supernova Gargantua! If you don't reshuffle, I don't reshuffle either! Fair enough, I don't reshuffle! Alright then! Then it's time! Interdimensional zombie should go on turn 1! Are you sure about it? Go, Interdimensional zombie! <laughs> Cytron, my dear! Come on! Just don't get me started with are you sure about it! I'm very sure about it! Why did you Morticia? Go Lima Pelodon! You don't go for my international zombie? Ouch! Ow! No, because... <laughs> well, I mean... Lima Pelodon gives me beanstalks if I don't sacrifice... Uh, it. Well, do not sacrifice Lima Pelodon, you know your plan needs to leave. Exactly. Good. Ah, oh, I don't have anything for turn two. No, me neither. Hmm. Ah, but I guess now he transforms to another one. Oh, so much better then. Perhaps you could transform into one that. Okay, yeah. I guess it works. Still, two damage. Oh! Ow! 
Deci Rima Preodan seems to be having me more dead than me Than a, a chimney sweep <laughs> Alright then I just need to be looking for ways to get you my dear It's too easy Go drowning I mean Go electrician Go science deck ain't gonna work on me Morticia It's too pathetic and weak Yes it is You're about to get damage in any of these lanes Point <laughs> I'm actually gonna survive Let's just defend with a peanut Doesn't matter what you do You'll get damage Chimney sweep Jesus Immortisha Come on with the chimney sweep And now I defend from him as well <laughs> What a waste You should've just attacked my peanut A peanut eh? Well my approach in dark magic Has thought that this random deck should be like pouch <sighs> I don't wanna lose the orange Screw that Go into dimensional zombie Ha <laughs> ha Bounty Hunter, I'm losing my patience to this orange Oh yeah, I bet you are Bounce with animational Bounty Hunter And then you're my proud in the middle lane <laughs> Behind my peanut ah! Ouch, oh! Damn Cytron, I think we're going to get really ugly with each other now But you're not blocking anything It's easy Why now get Doom Shroom? So bring Supernova again, sure <laughs> I think they're really smart Right? Go Kite Flyer And go Yeah, go Freddy Cat Let's see what you do against this, eh? Doom Shroom no longer active <laughs> It's absolutely fine Let's go freaking Bean Counter behind Walnut What a waste of time And then we need to protect from your cat Doesn't matter! Acid Rain! Haha! <laughs> Exactly! Go Freddy Cat! Go draw me a card! You know, perhaps the approach here was... Is going to be... A just helicopter! That's right! Helicopter and make a random zombie! I will not be having a lot of time defending all of these lanes, so make a random zombie right over there! Come on out, zombie! Ah, that's really weak, Morticia! <laughs> It's better off than getting my zombies destroyed by your Doom Shroom Oh yeah, pass this turn and I'll play Brainana Oh my, I guess it only goes one way around You will not use your Doom Shroom if I don't do this You bet I'm not Well this is just very important then Super the Magra Catcher! Ha <laughs> ha! Yo! <laughs> it just does nothing Immortisha Doom Shroom So do you I guess Yeah Immortisha my Freddy Cat moves! Yep! And your Freddy Cat just gets another pin in, in uh, its face. Ha! Huh. Allow me to get damage, Cytron! Oh no, you shall not. Well, I... I mean, I guess you used most of their stuff. Oh, it's gonna be enough now to get you, Immortisha. So cool! Ow! How about we start teleporting in? If you can deal with stuff on your turn, then that means teleporting stuff in will absolutely make me unstoppable! Oh yeah! Well, I only need a few more turns, so teleport nothing in! You are dead, woman! Ha! Jesus Christ! Ah! Yes! Oh! Ah! Banana! I, okay. Ah! Ah! <laughs> ah! No! Yeah, I win! Cytron beat me? Are you serious? Yeah! So, uh, Immortisha, you're eliminated. The end of the tournament already! Wow, and I just started! <laughs> Next time you call me over to a tournament, try not to get me eliminated in one fight! <laughs> Alright! <laughs> so that means, guys, Immortisha eliminated. Uh, let me just also make sure I do this. Okay, yeah, go. It is fine, honestly. Someone had to take the leap of faith. Are you singing to your own tune? Yeah. Okay, nice. Let's bang on the zombie room. Oh, Professor Brainstorm. Yes. So I play against Professor Brainstorm. Oh yes! Oh, 
can't wait to tell Solar Flare a very nice fact that will make you feel inst instantly smarter. <laughs> really, Professor Brainstorm? Exactly. All right, well. I'm very excited to hear it. I bet you are Solar Flare, but you need to cultivate that tiny mind of yours. You know what I say. Sure. So everyone may become smarter as you. Exactly. There are actually 125 facts, but I can only tell you one of them. Why? Are you lazy? No! It's just that a mind of you cannot process more than one. So, oh Jesus, really? Nope. Just one shall be shared. Alright. Okay. Start! Random decks. Let's just see what your random decks are made out of. 14 people online there. That's insane. Holy shit. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Look how much Professor Brainstorm got on his screen. Exactly, that's 40 people online all gathered to see a genius mastermind in action. Yeah, like holy shit. He has a lot of admirers. Exactly, they're looking at me right now. Well, either that or they're all doing their, whole thing, their, their um, own thing. No, I think they're all gathering for me. Ah, yeah. <laughs> you like to think that, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I saw the randomness. Exactly. Alright, Solar Flare. So let us begin the tournament by nicely and nicely telling you this scientific fact. Oh, yes, tell me. <coughs> there are more card deck combinations than there are atoms on Earth. Exactly, my dear child. And you know why? Why? Because you put so many cards in your deck. The more cards you put, the more you'll realize how many more combinations there are that you could combine. And start playing with. There you go, Solar Flare. That was the fact that I wanted to share with you. Wow. Really, you just opened a whole new universe for me. Exactly. <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm glad you think that. Well, now it's just 1% of my science point of view. But from my perspective, I think there is an infinite way. Which pretty much said already. But anyways. Prof randomness. One of us will win and the other one will get eliminated. Oh yes, let's get you eliminated. But uh, perhaps let us not have the random chances in science that I lose. I say I have be qualified here to win against you. Uh, sure. Uh, first of all, I'm gonna start reshuffling. I'm a man of science. I do not rely on slow stuff. I do not need you. Electrician. Teleportation. Double teleportation zombie. That <coughs> could come in handy. Now drawing cards is also slow, so I'm not falling in. Like other zombie heroes drawing too many cards. Teleportation zombie and Discotron 3000. Okay. Well, my stuff here is pretty good. I don't need to reshuffle. So be it, Solar Flare. But a great man like me reshuffles. Why wouldn't a great sunflower like you do the same? Because, well, I like to play more aggro. So do you then. Throw two cards. Through science, I shall get... D that, that, that double pirate's booty. Noted in my research book. D double pirate's booty. One of the worst <laughs> possible things I could get. Ow! That is really, really bad. So I'll start by poking your primal sunflower and then easily, easily teleport more zombies in. Oh yes, go on. Yes, fellow sea radish hunters. Jesus, son of rhino. You played well as you Hunters, which means I'm on the pass. Yes. Ow! There you go. I kindly poked your primal sunflower. And now what? Now I just need to teleport gravestones in. Some zombie heroes think this is a bit too slow, but I, for one, think this is fine. Since I can get to play one, and I'll pretty much be defending for more than one turn, which could buy us both time. So, uh, that's what I'm gonna do. And I actually teleport in another teleportation zombie. I don't think it's really wise. Yes, it shall be. Oh, but she's not. She's not wise. Oh, yes, I am. Sunflower seed. Yay. You should really get to more ramping. I'm pretty sure that will uh, favor you. No. Be it as it may. I should do drone engineer. I mean, electrician. I'm not talking about drone engineer. You might really need him. Not exactly. If I use this pirate's booty, which seems to be like the slowest and most inefficient cart out of all, I can actually create something good in my hand. But I'll need to use it with a lot of zombies on the field. 
And safe to say I will not have these unless I teleport in double teleportation zombie, which is exactly what I'm going to do right now. Oh well, well, we are just gonna wait while I teleport double teleportation zombies in. I mean, you're pretty much protecting against everything I do. Oh no! But wait, fireweed and I get fireweed and uh, primal sunflower professor. Is that good? Told my cap as well that it's just a bit too slow, and he understood. Oh, I need this one teleportation zombie alive, why not? Oh, but you made me a sunflower. Which gets poked immediately after the battle starts. Alright, double teleportation zombies, teleport, teleport. There you go. Oh, wow. Now I'll be able to use pirate's booty to draw myself good means of countering. So let us start, solar flare. Oh, you'll be taking four damage if you do that. I mean, I have... Ah! Oh, none of this is tough luck, but... Triple Pirate's Booty, I'll just have to use one for the science's sake. Yeah, or for the pirating's sake. Or what? Player Rose, yeah. There you go. Well, this will only draw me three cards, which is unfortunate. I don't think there's any zombie hero who could, who could pull out five cards drawn for one turn. That would just get you milled. But as I said, Solar Flare drawing me three extra cards. A Neutron Imp. A Bad Moon Rising. And a kite flyer. Well, now your zombies are too dead from Briar Rose. So it seems like it. <laughs> and that is ah, down to 8 hit points. Let's see where this science carries me. I should be able to conduct something really good. That will hopefully start getting you a uh, low on HP eventually. Well, hurry up. What do I start teleporting in now? Nothing. Cherry bomb. If you threaten me with cherry bomb, I'll be forced to just go. This got thrown 3000. There you go. This should be the only thing that buys me enough time, but if I combine this with Headhunter, it'd be the only condition I could get to damage you. And when are you gonna play him? True stuff, I cannot play him without you taking care of him. So I guess this nearly always happens. Exactly, Solid Flare. This got thrown 3000 to protect my face in all three lanes. Yeah. What is your move? Oh, while you do that, I guess I could take time for a banana launcher. Yes. And then, uh, are you going to destroy my bio rose? What do you think, my dear child? Is this Cotron 3000 not a 4 attacking card? Uh, I think it is. <coughs> exactly! So that means I'll be most likely dealing with it this turn! Oh, uh, yeah. Yep. I guess I do nothing. You could still go for him. No, 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 no. I, I want Transfigurate. Um, I mean, I want my reincarnation as something great. So, do you, Solar Flare? Well, let's get a backup dancers to counter your banana. I mean, um, no, 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 no. A Disco Zombie to counter your banana. Ah, ha, ha. And then a backup dancer to counter your Velocity Radish. That's at one hit point. Science completed. Wow. There you go. Science in the middle of tournament is dangerous. But it's surely gonna win me the game, Solar Flare. Talk you for one more additional damage. Our dry arrow's done. Ouch! Exactly. I could also start Ban Moon Rising right away, but I could wait a few more additional turns and this should be able to finish you off quite easily. Well, you cannot go Ban Moon Rising if I have Cherry Bomb. No, 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 <laughs> that is right, I really cannot. You should start Headhuntering. Oh, that's right, I have a really good zombie I could Headhunter run over here. Alright, I will try it, Solar Flare. Go Headhunter. <laughs> headhunter on top of Disco Zombie. I guess that's the synergy that could work uh, thanks to Discotron 3000. Yes, thank him. And then I might as well just uh, defend this then with an electrician. I could get you for 5 additional damage with Bullseye there. Ah, oh, Professor, you're going really strong there. Exactly, my dear child. You thought we are gonna play like this forever? Like, nice? Yes, I really thought so. You disappointed and broke my heart. I'm sorry. Well... Oh, that's right, might or not. And... Still for t oh. <laughs> well, it's fine. You do a bonus attack and you let the nut hit you, right? You somehow got a Myron nut there. From reincarnation. Alright, the weird science comes, I guess. Exactly. However, I shall only be required to do one with the um, electrician. The faster I deal with this annoying, um, uh, cute velocity radish hunter, the better. Exactly. Yeah. Now he's dead, I no longer have to be concerned that I'd get damage for 6. That's pretty good. Damn. I block this and get a make a random zombie. Will you make him? 
I always need to make sure I kill this in case you're thinking you can get me for damage on the lane. Ouch! <laughs> for now, I'm only damaging you by one because I got no other choice. Yay! Let my Myro not get you, Professor. Yay! So I should start doing this instead. Aha! Uh -huh. Bad Moon Rising is the option right now. It's not gonna work. <laughs> yeah, it just looks like it's not gonna work. I need to get you to waste your cherry bomb. I have double cherry bombs. You're never gonna get me to waste them. Never you say? I'm really sure you have to waste them right now. If you know what's good for you, my child. I'll do this cut around 3000. Yeah, these are your last ones. You know, Professor, you're really rich in cards. I can't. See that? Pirate's booty wasn't in... Wasn't exactly a useless card after all. If you have a brilliant mind like I do, you'd know how to make use of it. Yeah. Oh well, destroy them! Cherry bomb, yay! <laughs> and now Solar Flare, you'll be forced to defend against the Mire or not. Not exactly, I'd be better off not defending against it since it only does one damage to me. Yeah, true. Let's make a... Disco Zombie there that survives. And then definitely not try to poke your... Mire or not. But why not poke it? Come on, it's only like one damage difference. No, I say. At least not the right way to go. Next, I could make a random zombie, and since you're low on cards, I could really just get you down with the band Moon Rising. Ow! Ah. You could, but don't you think it's slow? Oh, I think it's actually really, really perfect here. I have another cherry bomb, yay! <laughs> I gotta hurry up, you're getting to my cherry bombs. I'll keep using them. <laughs> so, I need to get you concerned here, <laughs> which means means what? I might do just one bad moon rising instead. Really? Why just one bad moon rising? Because I know this is a better way. Plus you only have one cherry bomb. No, actually this is fine. I'm gonna make a random zombie. Summoning I mean. And bad moon rising. Perfect my dear child. I can only get one of them with the... Uh, two of them with the cherry bomb. Oh, it's true. I mean, it kind of makes me question why you hold back so much. Ah, let's do this too, Professor. <laughs> sure! Do it to your heart's content. Close it to your face. Yay! <laughs> well. It's time we make science be hurt, Solar Flare. Make a random zombie in the middle lane. That is going to be through science zombie's best friend. That will make another random zombie. Jesus, that is so lucky! Exactly. And since you cover this lane, I can also cover it. Get an overshoot, zombie. And now it's time for Bad Moon Rising! Hey, yeah! Jeez! Flamencos and binary stars. Professor! Ow! Oh! Ow! You're dead. What? What? And I'm gonna heal myself with Nuzgur Gantuar for 12 damage. Ha! Ah, beautiful, beautiful science, is it not? <gasps> but how is this possible? That is so. Ow! Oh! Oh, come on! And that is the game! Yeah! <laughs> Come on! Oh, that was harsh. <laughs> oh, there you go! I had to carefully execute it so I make sure you don't get a chance to hurt me too much. <laughs> oh, you know my deck is a lot more easy going than yours. Why would you do this? I'm eliminated. Oh. Hmm. Professor, that is, a, that is really harsh. I know, science can often be harsh in quite a lot of ways. If played correctly, it favors you, Solar Flare. <coughs> oh, yeah. No, it favors you. It looks like Solar Flare is eliminated. Ah. Great shout against Supper Brains. Ah, Supper Brains. Supper Brains! Exactly. With uh, your random decks. But of course. Let's go then, Green Shadow. Right, we then are fighting against each other, of course. Of course! Sup, brains! <coughs> that is, um... Uh, last time I fought against you, you, you seriously kind of struggled against me. But if I remember correctly, I still won in the end against you. No, you didn't. Oh, uh, no, I didn't. Well, who even cares? I forgot, in a ways. Sup, randomness! Ready to win the tournament once again? Oh, no, you're not. 
At the very least, ready for a very nice and hot date, perhaps? Yes, you are. P randomness. This will be your last hot date before you're going to play. To uh, get eliminated, I mean. Ha 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 ha! Sabre brains! You really think one such as I gets eliminated so easily by one P hooded shooter like you? Yes. Very well. What if I do double beam me up, eh? But are you sure that's wise? Double da a science deck. Ah, oh, I clearly beat your ass last time with my potato zoruses. Oh, um, no. Kite flyer, beam me up. I don't need kite flyer, green shadow. Double interdimensional zombie. And teleport. That's what I need to beat you. Alright, so I have him up here. Being counter does not count. Two, three bonus attacks and split pee. This should be pretty aggro too. Ha! <laughs> oh, green shadow. You just know I'm stunning you with the water lane, so you have no chance. You have to go on the ground lane instead! Ho <laughs> ho! Interdimensional zombie green shadow, don't forget! Uh, yeah, I'm not scared. Your Lima player done, I see! You still go brave with it. Ouch! Ooh! But one of us will win, the other one will fail. So green shadow! Another interdimensional zombie! Ho! <laughs> Science zombie! A back a devil! Pet zombie! Well, guess that will also work! In one of the other fantasies, that is. <laughs> you just keep taking my time. Oh, I have him! You have an Abracadaver problem there, Green Shadow. He's going to hit your Lima Plerodon! Ah, oh, yeah, you're right. So what are you going to do? Well, let's just counter him for now. Aha! Uh -huh. That's what I thought! Supper brains! Go deadly! I knew I'd have getting you to defend against them. Ha! Ouch! Ah. Brains? Oh! Well then, I believe it's time we do teleportation zombie. Supper brains, go teleportation zombie. Yeah, in the middle lane. Congratulations, I'm gonna block and get attack you for five damage. Grow him up, little down. Let's end super brains. Not this time, green shadow. You're gonna be slow. Dance form, raiding raptor. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I block. I didn't exactly get attack for five damage this turn. Well, let's get our Raiding Raptor frozen, so for the next turn, he will not attack. Sha! Sha! Oh, this is going to... <gasps> oh! Oh! You made me bounce my head! Hey! <laughs> Too easy! <laughs> Alright then! Time we start more damage! <coughs> so we're gonna snap out of this easy zone of yours. Mad Chemist show me the play! Supper Brains! Ah, Mad Chemist? Exactly! All I have to do is... Uh, aha! Now I gotta go for your Raiding Raptor first. That's right. You get damaged by 3 and 1, Green Shadow. I will catch on, catch back to you in no time. The next I conjure a trick, I should get something from that chemist. That will help me deal with your Lima Plerodon. Ouch! Oh, oh god! There you go! Thankfully I was ready to block this. <laughs> Jesus, your reflexes went to from 1 to 10. You mean from 6 to 10? Or oh, whatever. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, Green Shadow! Whoa! So it looks like you've not got my Raiding Raptor yet. That's at 8 strength. Oh no. Guess what I have here, Green Shadow? Guess what card I have here to finish you off, Green Shadow? That's right. Electrician! Raiding Raptor. Oh no! Oh yes, and you have absolutely nothing. Your hand is 6 casting and triple express of fiesta. You are done for. God. Um, I don't have anything. Oh no. Uh, is this it? This is it, my dear. Supper brains. Oh no. Ouch. Ow. Ah. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. That was so quick. Ah, the damn raiding raptor was the only thing. Oh god. Well, Green Shadow, you had one turn there. You had one turn, and you could not do anything. Oh god. Sorry to disappoint you, but no matter how fast you thought you could get me in the water lane, you had failed. Impressive, jeez. Oh, oh damage with international zombie. Next time I'm telling you to counter him, you make sure you counter him, Green Shadow. Okay. Well, my random deck has failed me. Wow, Green Shadow, unexpectedly. Exactly! Not just a science deck, a random one! The best sort! <laughs>
That means Green Shadow is officially out of the tournament. Yeah. <laughs> Two Plank Heroes have been eliminated so far. So, um. <coughs> As Plank Hero, you better make sure you eliminate the next zombie hero. So, let's see. Oh, that was gonna happen eventually, guys. Interdimensional zombie would pull off some crazy shit, as you saw that. <laughs> next Plank Hero, next zombie hero. <coughs> Are we gonna have this match this time? So, let's see. Rose? Ha ha ha! Against Neptuna. Neptunians! And the, the random decks, I guess. Sure, I didn't enjoy last time I played random decks, no good. So you got your ass kicked pretty hard by the knight, nonetheless. Alright, well, surely this time around is something else. We're in tournament, I can, I can reshuffle. Last time I couldn't reshuffle, which ended up being in my disadvantage. Yeah. Well, let's get you the super brainy team. <laughs> okay, it's already selected. And, uh... Rose, get my solar ramp smarted. Yeah. There you go, Nerdloy. And mine plays first. You hear that? Do you hear that, Neptuna? Sure, I do, Rose. You know, magic for us Neptunians is thrown into the. Yes, yes, I know. It's thrown into the freaking black hole. Don't tell me 10,000 times. Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. I didn't want to spam that much. <laughs> well then, Neptunians! The power shall be relinquished! I mean, revealed! I mean, unleashed! <laughs> Honestly, I could just play with these words a bit more. Oh, yes. <laughs> Let's go Rose Randomness then. Ooh, I heard you have some pretty good combos there. But, I'm pretty sure there's nothing compared to what I dealt with Knight. So prepare yourself. Tuna randomness will bring you down, Rose. Oh, I'm way too easy going for this. Which is why, because we're hardcore, hardcore, we are going to win. No, you're not. <laughs> I got so magic beans. Lima Plerodon. A nice bean counter that I should reshuffle. With twin sunflower. Uh, also a nice sunflower seed. You better make sure you have enough or us Neptunians will counter you. Two twin sunflowers. Oh dear, so magic beans? Sorry. I don't want that. My bird the paradise has got... Has absolutely the best way to get you. We'll see about that, Rose. I got ink mascot and line dancing zombie. Line dancing is not a sport zombie. It's still a dancing zombie, which is extremely good. Well then. Go, intergalactic warlord! And on turn one, I mean planetary gladiator. That's what I thought. <laughs> well then. I mean, we should start transmogrifying straight away. Oh, I'll get something very, very good. Of that you be certain. No, you won't. Turn into a baseball zombie. Or a nymph. See, I told you. <laughs> well then, you're good at enhancing and enchanting stuff. <laughs> oh, I see you. Well then, you're not the only good. The only one who's good at seducing people. I too seduce people really well. Really, do you? Yes, of course. Just look me right now. I'm seducing you with my grand plays. <laughs> Oh, as if. I bet that him couldn't even go through if I placed some sunflower in his face. Why would you do that? Because after all, it's just a one attacking imp. You'd never ever be able to touch these twin sunflowers. This is so good, dear. <laughs> well, gee. I never thought you'd think like this. <laughs> Us Neptunians will show you no mercy. Go in! You had no turn to play. Oh, This is gonna be a bit too early then. I'm gonna play my Bird of Paradise on the water lane. <laughs> well, you think I am slow. But truthfully, I can get you for 3 damage over here. With Line Dancing Zombie. Go Line Dancing Zombie! On 4th flame. Line Dancing, would you look at that? Exactly! You have hard times dealing with it. <laughs> Just a bit of hard times, dear. Not really that many hard times. Oh. Let's just do Bird of Paradise. 
Or I could just start ramping even more while you take your sweet ass time. It's never a good idea. Wow, wow, wow. You're wasting too many twin sunflowers. Oh, I bet on all Neptunians you're gonna regret it if you do that. Oh, I have a feeling I'm just not gonna regret it anymore. I have Space Cowboy, you fool. Alright, alright. Let's just do this then. And Primal Sunflower instead. <coughs> Yours is the poorest of all stuff after all. We know it. We Neptunians can see through your hand. So can you. Let's move my land dancing zombie to the heights. The heights advantage. Yee-ha! Ow. Oh. Oh. Well, wow. <laughs> it's okay now, actually. You had just played your rim upload on the water lane instead of saving it for the bird of paradise. <laughs> and you know what that means. What does it mean? It means I go. Oh, will you go it? Sure about it? Yeah, definitely. Go, space cowboy! <laughs> Dear, alright. Now I have double strike through and I'll get you for more damage. There you go. Perhaps it's desperately time for the board of the paradise. Desperately. <laughs> you said it right. There is nothing you can even do. I lose one twin sunflower. Perhaps it's fine. I'm gonna build a wall out of these twin sunflowers. Neptunians! She only has twin sunflowers! <laughs> Your Neptunians love that. Let's just get this cowboy at one strength. Let's just block that as well. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to hide my space cowboy for now, Rose. Go in a gravestone. Oh well. You are really out of cards there, Rose. Oh. You need... You need more cards, I repeat. Perhaps tactical cute. <laughs> I need a bird of paradise to save me here, truthfully. You're just relying on one bird of the paradise? Yeah. I can ruin it next turn. Thanks to the toxic wasting, but let's just let it live for a bit longer. It seems quite playful for now. Indeed. <laughs> Still out of card anyways. It doesn't really matter. I can just line dancing zombie. And then space cowboy right next turn. You don't even have much. <laughs> oh no. Truthfully. Oof! <laughs> you are weak. I shall start devouring your line dancing. Chum. Ha! Got you. It is really weak. <laughs> You're better off with a control deck than a random deck. Well, dear, I was in a bit of a disadvantage. We're gonna let go of everything. Hmm. I should protect this sunflower seed for now. Doesn't matter how much sunflowers you get. It really doesn't. Go line dancing zombie. And then space cowboy. We Neptunians are gonna win. <laughs> Ow. Oh. Dear Neptuna, come on. Ow. <laughs> you have nothing. We're ending this tournament, Rose. Well, just give me a chance. There you go. You're my player done. You wouldn't have come. You would win with that many sunflowers in your hand, did you? <laughs> oh, but this bird of the paradise could still make me win. Oh, yeah. That would be really, really a nice coincidence. Surely. <laughs> You think just one is enough? I think it is. <laughs> How about I get you forced to deal with the ground lanes instead? Anti-hero 3. This will do 6 damage to you. Not really bad. But Space Cowboy is just much more superior. Go Space Cowboy! <laughs> oh. Dear, it is time I move my... S oh, dear. So much strife through. You'll be forced to captain. You'll be forced to cuke the wall ground. Nuke the wall ground. By Neptunes. Would you look at that, Rose? <laughs> oh dear. Am I now? 
You are going to take too much strife when you're gonna be dead. I shall move my floor to the paradise. Yes, of course, I could do this first. And then I no longer need the ground lanes. Jesus! Why Neptunes? That is outrageous. You just defeated all of my zombies. Yes. Keeping the frenzy for the shark to mix up would just mean little straight up. Right and moves I pass. Perfect. Oh! Oh! Neptunes! Oh, would you look at that? The border paradise is suddenly winning me the game. I can also heal myself now. <laughs> Why, Neptunes, you think that's enough? Your bird of the paradise gets answered right now! Go, Shark Tonic Sub! <laughs> oh dear. Then I could also not let your plans block, block my blog meter. After all, all you have is a few petty tutu plans. <laughs> you are too slow. Oh, why, Neptunes? I should start healing. No worries, this sunflower seed will work, and I shall get another board of paradise. You just too desperate! <laughs> you will not even have enough! He survives from both of your attacks. That's right. <laughs> and the sunflower seed sounds a bit angry and cute as well. Sure, dear. <laughs> why, Zama Chaktonic Sab will win! Oh, dear. Oh, no more, dear! It's time we rest you in peace! Another Shaktronic Sun! <laughs> rest in peace. Oh dear. What if I do this? <laughs> oh, you nearly let me have lethal. What about the planetary gladiator? You are forgetting now! And no weed whack is going to affect him, Rose. Go, Neptunians! Strike frenzy! Ow! Damn. How about I goatify him instead? Ugh. There you go. That would do it. <laughs> Why, Neptunes? You really think this ends here? Octopet. You are still poor. Ow. Oh, God. It ends right here. I just need to push for a way out. I will draw more cards by that time. Go! One last rider! Go, team mascot! <laughs> See how you deal against that! Oh, I should very easily do so. Sash, sash! <laughs> so magic beanstalks! Oh no, dear! Oh, this ends, doesn't it? Your magic is weak! Us Neptunians will throw it into the black hole! We win! Let's happy celebrate! Oh dear. Oh. oh. That is the end! Neptunians won! Looks like I did not get the good hand. Your random deck is really full of shit! It wasn't ever going to work, Rose. Oh well, I should still. I tried. Too bad I didn't even make it past one round. Well, a random deck's a random deck. <laughs> yes! Neptunians rank up! She had too many sunflowers in her glory. <laughs> she really thought she could pull it off with that many sunflowers. And just one board to the paradise and nothing else. Too weak in the end. It's true, Neptuna, that kind of was weak. Well then. Rose is eliminated! Um. My plan, heroes, we're still not getting any zombie killer eliminated. Are you sure you're doing okay? <laughs> nah, you, you better start working on you gotta fail the tournament again. Let's thank your next zombie hero. <laughs> ah! Nightcap against Rasbolt! Me against the Nightcap! Exactly. Which are random decks? your team first um kind of forgot um
I guess the I begin begin with my team. Yep. My glory. No, my f I know Nakia, but we had Rose team last time. Oh, all right. Well then, I cap, you are going to have a taste of my rest. Randomness, yes. Hmm, not sure about that, cyborg. I think I'll handle you pretty well with my deck. Alright then, try your best. Much randomness. I respect a good warrior when I see one. But so more do I respect the science that I have to offer. The cybernetic justice. That's what I truly came here for. Alright, sounds very good and reasonable. And I came here for the mushroom to show you the true power of us. Not with a random deck. Ha ha ha. Anyways, then interdimensional zombie, teleportation zombie, kite fire is too slow, and helicopter. Actually, I do not need helicopter. I have space cadet instead. Kite fire is not needed. I have drone engineer to conduct my science even further. Let us do this. Hmm. Most of you zombie heroes are gonna have random science. Exactly. A fireweed. Cool bean to freeze your gravestones. This will be good for a lot of turns. Not if you don't reshuffle. Ah 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 ah. This is going to be rather too easy. I can bounce your interdimensional zombie for this turn. While I hang on to my reincarnation. Let's see then. Bounce him. Ah ah ah. Interdimensional zombie. Interdimensional zombie. And the dimensional zombie gets bounced. Exactly. Back in your hand, Rust Bolt. So I shall have him safe. Back in my hand. Next time, I'm gonna use him to transform into something good. Oh. Another Dandelion King from Reincarnation. Not like you're gonna get to play it on turn 2. Ha! That thing gets played on turn 6. That lion plant, I mean. Dandy. Yes. Well then. Conducting my science only goes after I get my drone engineer. We shall not be set up right now because he'd be in danger of getting damaged. True. Have two of them. I could start teleporting him straight away to buy enough time. Just go teleportation zombie. Hmm. Alright then. And I have just another reincarnation in my hand. Oh, I could wait and these things could literally end up winning me the game last world. Exactly. That is going to need you a lot of turns. I feel like the confidence is flail. Take that fire with. It looks like I have dealt with her. You can only just teleport in one more zombie. Which is absolutely fine enough. Well. Hmm. I guess it's only gonna be cool bean right now. Which is why I think I'm gonna just teleport in the gravestone instead. You're freezing them for one turn. I'm gonna freeze him twice, actually. I guess I'm not gonna take the time to teleport then. Nope. Go zombie drone engineer. Go interdimensional zombie. Yep, that should be enough. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty flail, if you ask me. Oh, I'll freeze that one. <laughs> Thank you. You are only just struggling, encountering my zombies. This is pathetic. Oh well, it looks like Interdimensional Zombie is ready to teach you a lesson with the freaking bats. <laughs> bats aren't doing it. But I guess they should still draw me a card. I will get Helicopter. Sadly, not the thing I like. Your Teleportation Zombie just died to hot lava. He did die to lot, hot, lot, hot lava. But it's okay. Electrician will come in handy with his bonus attack. I shall conduct more science. Go drone engineer, go genetic experiment, and then I shall use shrink ray on whatever threatening plant you had there. Oh, this is pretty perfect. <laughs> if only I could have the height lane in my advantage. Ha ha ha, I had to get you to use the height lane sadly. I cannot use the um, Lily of the Valley properly now. Oh, what sadness. Oh, I cannot. This is too sad. Ha ha ha. Oh, very well then, let me freeze your gravestone. And then one next. And then since your sign zombies are so easy to answer, I'm just gonna go here. Right here with my blooming art. <laughs> it's too easy. You did misplay there. You wanted to go for the one you just throw so you would have got him. Oh no I don't. Let's just not have any damage on me. 
Is that the way you chose? Mm -hmm. Very well then, I shall take damage from your cool bin instead. Cause I'm more cool. And have your cool bin there to zero damage. Oh. So now I can use my double drone engineers to increase all of my science zombies damage. Except that one. Grow, grow. Next time I'll just bonus attack you. Oh, you'll not bonus attack me if I do. Lava guava. Lava guava detected. I shall let that one drone engineer get through then. They should be good enough. <laughs> oh, none of them go through actually. <laughs> if I do it right here. What a stupid and dumb idea. Yep, see? Very well then, I shall conduct my science even further. Electrician gets his damage increased to 3. And then my science counters your blooming art. Oh, look at this! You just lost your science. <laughs> see, I told you he wasn't gonna use you well, fool. Well, that does happen sometimes. But if I do kite fly right now, you will be in a lot of trouble. Oh, I can start Dandelion King right this turn. I shall bravely start Mad Chemist thing. I need more tricks. Oh, yeah? Oh, yes. You get damaged by 4 and by 3. Which is absolutely good. I get you low half each pointed. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, that's all you choose to do to me. How poor. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. I did drop to 5 hit points, it's true. See that? Just with one dandelion king. <laughs> I could just win right now with being counter in the middle lane. You will try to go being counter in the middle lane, but you don't have enough sun. Oh, barely enough, actually. It doesn't matter, you don't have enough sun. Time to make a random zombie and play it risky. And then hail a copter on the next turn. Oh, really? <laughs> This is cute, Rasbolt. Let's get you for 5 more damage. Yo, go on. Also give you a nice smile. <laughs> and then protect right here. That is only just more damage on my metallic face. Which I might as well just block. Oh, I'm rolling a 1, you know how it goes. You roll a 1 and you're dead. Not exactly. You see? Bam. Activate. Insta block protocol, heal for 6. Incredible! Oh. Exactly, I had blocked, and now I'm going to win this game, baby! Damn. You thought I was gonna get me, but playing it risky was a more successful step than ever. That was not. There we go. Oh, lucky. Helicopter bonus attack wins the world freaking game, baby! Let's go! Oh, damn it! What if I do it like this? You will not win the game just yet. I have a walnut. You pull off the walnut, eh? Alright then. And then a uh, metal petal. And my velocity radish hunters. Oh, I'm not gone just yet. Oh, but you will be. Alright then. Guess you are protected for now. Let's look out for the lane I could get you in. Let's use helicopter. Time for hail, hail, hail. Conjure me. Thinking cap. Oh god. Thinking cap is going to absolutely win me the game. And I do not lose my science army, which is perfectly fine. Well, what are you gonna do then? Bonus attack with a helicopter so I can get your bean counter. You should go for my velocity rally shunters. Didn't you hear they're really good for hurting the zombie hero's face? Oh, I did hear that a lot, but I think it's a false positive, which is why you are going to fail. <laughs> what? Anyways, I know that word did not use in this scenario, but I shall, shall still use it. Wow. So you're at 11 hit points, let's do you another Dandelion King. Feel free to Dandelion King how many times you want. Ha ha ha. I should do Captain Commando and Space Cadet, or just Thinking Cap and Space Cadet, and win the game. The end. Oh, I should do another one of my Dandelion Kings. Oh, uh, uh. very well then. Keep doing how many of them you want. I can't believe you're still living after all of that. Helicopter in the middle lane looks fine enough for me. Hmm. 
I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Your hand is full. Go helicopter on the middle lane. How are you thinking, Cap later? After hitting you for six, then. <sighs> Come on. The dimensional zombie transforms into an input deadly. The most annoying thing you could ever possibly think. Vampire. And then conjure me another bonus attack. I win this game. The end. Oh, come on. Ha 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 ha. Another bonus attack. That's right, baby. Suck on this. Oh. Oh. You don't win yet. It looks like just a bit of miscalculation. That's right. <laughs> you don't win. Oh no, no, oh, the smile, the smile of defeat, ah, 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 he just got so magic beans as his last card, he's now dead, ah, 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 oh no, I'm sorry Nightcap, it looks like you were super duper poor and helpless in the end, it is time we get this done with, oh no, not the smile, not the smile, no. The smile of defeat. <laughs> Thank you, Cap. <laughs> I never had such a laugh in my entire life. That is your last mean of defending yourself. So sad. Oh, I just, I just to see. Oh man, man, you got the nicest defeat out of all. <laughs> oh, I guess we all know how this ends. Helicopter. Come on, smash my dandelion king. You've already suffered enough. I think this is going to be the end of you. Ah. Oh no. Ah! Ah, 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 This is the most pathetic match I've ever played. <laughs> Let's end the game with you getting so magic beans. <laughs> the randomness, shit. I really couldn't have got some. Oh, nightcap. Whoa. Sorry for that language. I didn't mean to go like that. I thought you were gonna be more zen about it. Hmm. You know, this really didn't make much sense. But I feel really ridiculed having so magic beans in my deck at this point. <laughs> exactly. Really, really ridiculed. So magic beans. More like so your defeat. <laughs> uh, <laughs> God. Yeah, that's right. So your defeat. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> Yeah. Hand heroes, that's bad luck. Oh, it is indeed. Yikes. It feels like Grasbo has won a nice nightcap, which means my poor nightcap gets eliminated. No! Oh, damn it. Well, that was one way nightcap, but <laughs> so magic beans had it for you. <laughs> damn. Oh come. Nope, that does not go well. So my cap is now eliminated. Pangos are down to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Alright, Pangos, you're going down rather fast, but shout. Oh, my cap eliminated now? Yeah. Alright, let's bang your next zombie hero. And I only just used the science deck, this is sort of pathetic. How would I ever planned hero ever get that unlucky? Yeah, I don't know, that's... You were really lucky, like a science deck doesn't have that much of a win rate. If executed correctly, it always wins, baby. And I can't just gave me enough time. I, no, I didn't, you fool. I dumped the Lion King to the face twice. That was not enough. My science is much more calculated and stronger, as you can see. Yeah, you only just got lucky because I was poor then. Very poor. So, magic defeat. Ha, ha, ha. Jesus. <laughs> the, the smile of defeat. <laughs> just, just those magic beats. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> that is not cool. But that is very funny. <laughs> Sputo and infinity. Ah, infinity. Aha. Fighting against the big ass spot, sure. Put your random decks. Yeah, definitely we're not next to each other's teams, so I guess there you go. I get mine first. Nope, I get mine first. Don't even think about it. 
I mean, <laughs> I'll hide then. There you go. Exactly. I get my fist. And you don't. Do you have? Oh, look at Rank 1, how cute. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> um. <laughs> I don't know, that was funny. Oh, infinity again. Spudo. Spado! Spad the randomness! Yay! Gonna win! You're gonna lose this Spado! Anyways! <laughs> oh gosh, what has been happening with your decks lately, eh? I don't know, some of us got really unlucky. Against the science decks? If anything else, I thought you would lose against me, not against their strategy decks. I mean, Rasbold and Professor Brain some are kinda smart. Yeah, yeah, I bet they are. <laughs> Anyways, in randomness. I surely are not end up by night, yeah? I surely you won't. You'll end even worse. <laughs> oh well. It was a nice meeting. <laughs> if we start at my carnival, this is gonna be way too easy. Oh no, it's not. Double dum room. I just one, come on. And then I need a one drop to get you. If you don't have a one drop, I can push you for little so easily. I got popping puppies for backup. You're never getting to them. The cat has not. Oh no! Mushroom! But I could get my starting superpower. Yes, it's gonna be too easy. Do I even need to reshuffle? No, any cosmic dancer. Mixed up Grave Digger instead. Let's see this. Oh gosh, it's too easy. I, um, we'll start with my potato mine. It's your hothead. Wow, really desperate. <laughs> Alright. Let's sacrifice the grave digger then. Exactly. Oh, there you go. I'm gonna throw him up. Yeah, you should really save that against something more strong. That is just too attacking and it's just turn one. Already bad. <laughs> Uh, well, knowing how much weak stuff you have there, I'll just go banana bombs infinite on you. Infinite banana bombs, alright. So we will try. <laughs> alright, let's see what I do now. Ah, easy. Dancing instructor, I can easily just get you for 4 damage. I know, just 2. Cause then I go banana bomb here. Yes. So slow and no damage earned. Well. I guess this is not gonna be called much of a fight, is it? Yes, it is! Surely not, <laughs> this is a joke. Ha <laughs> Khazard Wizard! Can't me freeze environment. That is a nice trouble to get, girl, but um, that's all that you're gonna get. Fall with the freeze environment, I can just strike through any of the plants you play in front of aerobics instructor. That is gonna be me the game! <laughs> no! Yes, of course. Let's just go freezing environment right away. Again, I guess Spanish room is gonna be required. I don't have the choice. Okay, why what is can I do, man? Okay, what is that? Never mind, it's not gonna be required. I'm only gonna do a cosmic mushroom, and that's it. Are yeah, you sure about it? Yeah. The cosmic mushroom on the fourth flame. Uh, there you go, got the shelf mushroom. <laughs> and don't laugh, it's just a full attacking. This is really easy. Oh, I guess you wanted to go punish him after all. <laughs> yeah. No! Yes. No, whatever, I get another banana bomb. No! Yeah, already down to 14 hit points. You haven't even struck me once. Way too easy. Go Disconnot, go Grave Rubber, full out aggro, and go in deadly. <laughs> no, you said I didn't damage you for one. How about this instead? Double banana bomb. One more banana bomb. And then a banana launcher. The zombies are still weak, Infinity. I'm gonna get them. They now have Bullseye. Look at that. Let's apply deadly to them. Yeah. 4 damage to your face this turn, you drop to 10 HP. It's... Ow! 
There you go. And you lost the banana. <laughs> yeah, I got another banana launcher. Yeah, you had played that. Oh well, I guess uh, we know how it ends, um, Spudo. Go mix up Grave Digger! <laughs> Perfect, I have four lanes filled up with zombies. I get another superpower, Grave Robber who gets his damage increased by who knows how much. And then Discona. This is gonna destroy you if you don't pick up the right lanes. Uh, no, it's not. I'm gonna pick this and I'm gonna pick that. You lose. Exactly. Let's see how you damage me. That's exactly how I thought. You won. Very well. You might have gotten just slightly lucky there. <coughs> well, my Discord is alive. I got Punish Room. Now my Punish Room is probably feeding some of your zombies. So slow. I get carried away. I could just make it, make it little on the strike through environment anytime. Check that out. Yeah. Your punish room! Don't let him do anything! <laughs> Alright, last most of my zombies, that's true. You did! You can't lose more than that! You can lose everything you play. Actually, I'm gonna start killing myself so you don't try anything nasty. You lose! Oh, do I? Yes, you do! Let's see another superpower! <laughs> I get strengthening. Ah, oh, this is perfect! Getting carried away, strengthening! Freaking aerobics instructor, and you lose! Ah, uh, no! Or any of my zombies, it doesn't even matter, it doesn't have to be an aerobics instructor. <laughs> I'm not gonna die because I get to heal myself. If I strengthen that, you'll get 10 damage to your face. It does not matter. Captain Puppies, save me! <laughs> that's the Puppin' Puppies to save you, that's you. Yeah. <laughs> that's just do 5 damage to the aerobics instructor, and then you are gonna drop to literally. 4 hit points or block. They cat! Oh no! He's getting carried away! No, stop! You're not super brains! Ouch! Wow! Exactly. Ow! Damn it! <laughs> What's the matter? You were a bit more speechless there for a second. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, not a language, sorry. Grave robber and just a zombie, let's end it. <laughs> uh, well, scratch my butt, that was easy. Shut up! I'm the worst zombie killer I've ever seen. And you lose. Take this out. Bam, bam, you don't deserve to be in. You're ruthless. Relax, I don't have anything else here that you have to worry about. Not a single just a zombie. How's the matter? You're really scared. I'll replace that environment. Start to will protect me and give me a soul patch. That's right. This is too pitiful to watch, viewers. <laughs> Spadal just doesn't have anything. <laughs> yes, I do now. Yes, I do now. Hell, what do you got? You get damaged by four. That's right. Good, I love taking a hit from popping poppies. Ow! Good. I don't know. No. I tried this to zombie get defeated. Ah, yes. <laughs> well, I guess I win. It was nice to see you, Spado. No, you won't. No. Mm. Infinity environment. <laughs> Infinity environment, really? Yes, so good. Go. Then go! I'm alive, baby! I'm alive! I do not die! Ah! There you go. Oh, really? What if that primal potato mine just gets you killed? No! Um, no! No! I know, Mr. Mus I'm his slave! Oh, you're dead! No! Mr. Sam is only just tight once! Don't explode him! No! Once! Ah. <laughs> Jesus! I'm <laughs> just a zombie to win. There you go, line dancing zombie. Oh. Oh. It's the end. Oh, conjure me, please! I don't wanna die! Oh. Ah, this is so sad. Here, let the, the puff shrimp puff me a bit so you feel better. And then line dancing zombie faster. <laughs> F! Oh.
Too easy, I win! <laughs> oh! That was not supposed to happen! This is not... Oh, so did you say our zombie heroes don't have good decks? It was only a bad guy. This is way tomorrow we zombie. We plank heroes are gonna catch back. You really are no plank heroes already. You're gonna lose this tournament as well. What are you doing? No, I'm not. I am, but the other plank heroes do not. Oh. Well, you were, you were getting close there. But of course, I was gonna get something to strike your face with. Too easy. You were down at two hit points. Oh. Yeah, well then. See you tomorrow in the tournament, viewers. Yeah.